Let's go to Art Edwards in Corvallis, where the Beavers women, Art, just pulled off a win. <laughs> Yeah, just barely pulled off a win. The game with Boise State went to overtime, and Oregon State was able to win 80-75. to So as you can imagine, people are streaming out of Gill Coliseum right now, and they're happy about this. They are really excited. Uh, I'll tell you, for a time, it wasn't looking all that great for Oregon State. They kind of struggled in the second half of this one. You know, the Beavers seeded number four in the tournament. Boise State seeded number 13. Uh, you know, we have some pictures from the first half that we can show you. In the first half, it was Oregon State using its size and its experience, and they were able to get ahead by about nine points at the half. But in the second half, things really started to change. Oregon State only scored nine points in the, in the third quarter of this game and then had to rally in order to get it into overtime and finally coming up. Up, uh, with the victory 80 to 75. Now, we talked to some fans before the game, and I tell you what, they were feeling awfully confident at that point. Just put their whole heart in it, and we just love them. Oregon State is always on top, kicking butt every day. We're going to win. We're going to win. And then we'll move on. I think they're going to make it a Sweet 16. I think it's going to be a tough matchup with Louisville. Tough matchup. They're a great team, and they play well together as a team. So they were able to squeeze by and get that victory today. So that means that Oregon State is going to be playing fifth seed of Gonzaga on Monday uh, for the right to move on in the Albany Regional. Gonzaga beat Little Rock 68 to 51 in the first game that was played here at Gill Coliseum today. As I said, a lot of happy fans leaving Gill Coliseum right now. It was, <laughs> you hear them, it was up in the air for a while as to whether or not the Beavers would be able to get this victory. But they came through. 